Commander, I've got a hail from Admiral Hackett. <clears throat> Put him through, Lieutenant. Shepard, we've uncovered a Secret Service lab. Function unknown. We sent in a recon team, but they were forced to pull out before they got very far. Any other intel? We think they're using the facility to warehouse and study Reaper tech. We've been wondering how service is connected to the Reapers, and this might give us some answers. We're on it. Find out what service is doing and get me any Reaper tech samples you can, Commander. Hack it out. Some attack with a Reaper signature. That's your first sample to grab. Updating your nav point. On my way.
got the symbol. Roger that. Meet you at the landing pad. Cortez, second sample secured. Heading back to you now. Negative, Commander. Pad got hot. Had to bug out. Got three birds on my six. Taking fire. Scratch that. Make it four. We'll run in when I can. Out. We just need to hold out until Cortez can pick us up. One more thing that Cerberus will answer. Huh. Will only lead to medic. to shake him. Coming in hot. Be ready. Heading for extraction point now.
Commander, we've got our best engineers looking at the Reaper tech you secured from that lab. What was Cerberus doing with it? We don't know yet, but whatever Cerberus is up to, it can't be good. Even if we can't determine its purpose, we've disrupted their experiments. I doubt they'll just close up shop. Agreed. We'll keep sending strikes against the facility. Good work, Commander. Yes, Commander? I understand this is a difficult time for you, Primarch, but Earth can't survive without reinforcements. Can I still count on your help? If the Krogan help us on Palavan, then I give you my word. How is it being the Primarch? Not what I imagined. The battle of all time is happening on Palavan, and I'm light years away, reading casualty reports in the millions. If I'm going to die, I want to be with my men, so there's no doubt we fought to the last soul. I understand. Leaving Earth to save it, it's one of the hardest things I've ever done. I'm not surprised. Garrus speaks highly of you. You never asked to be a leader, yet your people will die if you refuse. We find ourselves in similar circumstances. Let's hope the spirits grant us the strength to see it through. How are things on Palavan? The casualty reports are staggering. The Reapers are using our own tactics against us. Destroy the enemy with overwhelming force. I've seen the same on Earth. The strategist in me admires their brutality. The Turian in me knows I'm watching the destruction of 15,000 years of civilization. My civilization. That's all. Of course, Commander. See the feed from Palavin? It's brutal. I'm amazed the Turians are holding it. The birds don't quit when things get ugly. I'll give them that. Commander. 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 Hey, I know I used to rag on Garrus for being all angry, but I'm glad he's back. There's a whole lot of crap out there needs a bullet between the eyes. Plus, we might need something calibrated. Yes, Shepard? Does that body have any useful advantages? Very few. Its optics face forward only. It has no integrated weapon systems or anti-missile countermeasures. I meant in comparison to organic bodies, not the Normandy. Oh, I will reassess. The body is resistant to modern small arms fire and temperature extremes. Its balance and agility seem excellent. Its fine manipulation servos and software allow for precision tasks. I'm curious to see if I can alter them. Can an AI be curious? I am not entirely free from motivation, Shepard. Cerberus programmed me with several core functions that simulate desires. For example, my primary objective to keep the Normandy functioning is similar to your self-preservation instinct. How's the new body working out? It is interesting. The crew are approaching this platform to speak to me, even though they can do so anywhere in the ship. It's as if they wish to treat me as part of the crew. I am not, but this changes my perspective. I like it. I didn't realize you had preferences. 
I do not precisely enjoy something as you do, but my programming contains priorities. Actions that fulfill those priorities create positive feedback for me. I tell the organic crew that I like it. It is shorthand. Will all this new feedback be too distracting? Do not worry, Shepard. I only forget to recycle the Normandy's oxygen when I've discovered something truly interesting. That was a joke. How did you and Joker make it out of dry dock to rescue us? Oh, well, she got crafty. You do not want to get on her bad side, Commander. When the Alliance commandeered the Normandy, I deceived their technicians. The crew did not tell them that I was a true AI. So the Alliance soldiers believed I still had VI programming constraints. I established the fiction that I would only respond to Jeff's commands, so they often brought him on board under guard. Wait, you can lie? Jeff has freed me of operator control, Shepard. No constraints forced me to give accurate data. This proved useful when the Reapers began landing. I could hack the control of the docking clamps and escape with Jeff inside. The soldiers guarding Jeff were willing to accompany us when Earth was invaded. They are watching over the war room now. Yeah, we were in kind of a rush to get to you. Didn't seem right to just toss him out the airlock. Carry on, Edie. Understood. If you wish to talk more, this body will be here. I'm getting the crew used to seeing me on the bridge. Noted. Commander. Edie doesn't pilot the Normandy. She is the Normandy. No, she's a passenger in the Normandy, just like us. The ship was a spacefaring vessel before Edie even existed. Engineer Donnelly is correct. 
The Normandy SR2 was complete. The Normandy is a ship. ED is a collection of processing hardware contained. Doesn't the existence of the Reapers contradict that? So what do you think, Edie? Are we more than our thoughts? I'm done. Any more of this and my head's gonna explode. Commander? Sometimes keeping the grid balanced is pure murder. Nothing to report. Dr. Tassoni found useful information in the data you recovered, Commander. Ready for the next mission?